Hi, everyone. Glad you're with us tonight. I'm Darren Kramer. I'm Ann Nyberg. We're following a developing story tonight at Online where firefighters fought a house fire. And it started at a cottage on Hartsford Avenue just before 6.30 tonight. The fire was so intense, the flames spread to another house there. News 8's Sarah Welch live in Online tonight with the very latest. What can you tell us, Sarah? Darren, we're standing a few blocks from the fire scene just over my shoulder and around the bend of fire earlier this evening. Neighbors describe hearing a loud boom and then saw flames. Dozens of firefighters swarmed this house on Hartford Avenue. Scary moments for people living in this old Lyme neighborhood who heard a boom and then saw flames. It was just a real loud explosion and when I came down the stairs from my, my house, uh, all I seen was a lot of smoke until I got to the scene. That I've seen a lot of smoke and flames. Several fire departments responded. The call came just after six. Fire inside this house, just a few hundred yards from the beach. The heat and flames burning the rental next door. We saw we had one fully involved and one partially involved, as you can see over there. Uh, so the first thing we did is uh, is try to knock down this fire here with the uh, teams also trying to suppress the fire in the second building. James Salvatore owns the rental and says no one was in the house when the cottage caught fire. Yeah, no one was in it, so that's good. They own it and they stay here on the weekend and then it, there's another cottage in the back that they rent out. The fire is now out. The uh, fire investigation ongoing. The cause under investigation tonight. The gentleman, again, who owns the home is so grateful that nobody got hurt. Live in Old Lyme, Sarah Welch, News 8.